Hi, beautiful people. Welcome back. My name is Lenka. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the bell. If you're back here, welcome. So, all of you lovely people, hope you are having a wonderful day. Today, I've got another Dreamer Designs unboxing. Because actually it came in the same package, but... And the one that I bought is the one with the little chickadees. Garden Bird Trio. And it's by the same artist, namely uh, David Galchut. So it's the same artist that made the sun. Actually, I also wanted to buy the monarch. You know, the one with the butterflies, but that was sold out at the time. So I got this and actually I got this because I've got some birds in my garden as well. And they're not chickadees, they're um, great tits, but they do look a little bit the same as those. They've got also the yellow feathers and the blue and the black hat, so... I think those are chickadees, but I don't mind. I, I I love birdies. So, let's get into it. It is a 40 by 60 and round, I believe. So, that's not a really big one. And I do like the Dreamer design quality. And I believe they also changed up their drill fields a little bit because it's true they, there used to be something wrong sometimes but now I don't know I, I find them really clear so and I love the way this comes with a bow in a cotton bag with the logo Oops. and I dropped it already this is the toolkit, very soft, soft baggy. So yeah, I really like the way they kit up their things and, and the way they handle it so. But there weren't too many designs that I really liked, but those of, of the David Gelshut, I must say, I like the style of it, so I bought those two. What do you get in your toolkit? Two squishies, purple squishies, everything is purpley. That's really... And two um, containers of wax with the logo. You get a special pen for picking up ABs. Then you get another pen, a normal, regular pen, diamond painting pen. You get sharp tweezers with the logo of Dreamers Designs. And I want you to focus. I want you to focus. Like this. Okay. Okay. There we are. Are we there? <gasps> yeah. My camera doesn't know what to do. It's like, what do you want? Woman, there, there, here, here. Okay, so always put the sleeve back on, very sharp thingies. You get two boats with the Dreamer Design logo. You get a tool that's great for straightening up your lines when you're a multi-placer. You get these and I don't really use them, as you know, this is a two-placer, this must be a five-placer or a four-placer, I don't know. But they're the thick kind, and I prefer the thin ones, so there you go. That's what's in the toolkit. And, oh, no, not, not done yet. You get loads baggies. Okay. Uh, rips, whoop. I'm dropping everything. Everything is falling to the ground. So, then we've got the beautiful canvas with the bow that I like to... 
unwrap like oh, I love this <laughs> it's poured glue of course oh and I'm gonna roll it backwards you get a, a walking legend it's really curled up so get a folder you get a noodle and you get of course your canvas or oh, this is a small this is gonna be fun in between in between big canvases okay <gasps> I'm already crinkling the plastic okay there we go just a little bit more you can do this this because it's poured glue you know you don't do it with double-sided adhesive and there we go the, oh there's a uh, a ladybug I hadn't noticed and the flowers and the tree chickadees <laughs> look at them they're so cute so let's take a look at the drill fields shall we huh <laughs> please help wait sometimes it it works when I tap my 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 phone but now it doesn't seem to work so if you don't see the drill fields too clearly don't mind it's my phone that doesn't want to focus it's not the drill field because the drill field is actually pretty clear pretty clear beautiful flower this one I don't know if they're actually existing flowers but I love them nevertheless and I love the colors the blue it's more purpley blue pink it's it's a little bit of everything so yeah this one I found this one to be very interesting of course this one is one I'm going to make and maybe give away or maybe hang up in my house I don't know I don't know drill field very good so I set 40 by 60 um, let's take a look at the drills because ah it's got 59 colors so the legend is on both sides and let's see how many ABs we get we got four ABs yeah so oh I'm really pleased about that I love my ABs so sorry crinkling oh, I'm sweating guys it's really rainy outside we have some some thunderstorms and in lots of parts of Belgium everything flooded oh, and um, it's strange because it's really rainy but it's very hot so yeah strange kind of weather so let's go over the drills quickly 59 colors for a small painting like this I really like that really like that so let's go we've got 3371 euro 3371 wait I'm gonna do it like this maybe it will focus a lot better of course 3371 3607 very beautiful pink Oh, and it's a square. I forgot. <laughs> so, um, 3743, 3747, 3756, 3070, lovely peachy color, 3815, I believe. I'm very sorry, but it's very gloomy out and I don't, I should put on my lights but then I'm gonna have glare so 38 16 yeah 38 34 38 35 oh that's lovely purple it's not it's like dirty pu purple you know it's it's hmm I love this color very much very beautiful so next string and then 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 this way oh what am I no this way sorry 
9.15, that's also a beautiful color, and 9.20. Okay, next one, 500, 501, 518, 519, oh, 550, beautiful purple, 550, uh, Uh, 645. I don't know if you're hearing that, but somebody is calling me. Okay, sorry. 645, 646, 676, 618, 629. <sighs> uh, okay. Mm. 921, 922, oh beautiful orange, 930, 931, 831, sorry, 8, 930 and 931, oh, it's difficult to read, 932, 938, 939, 976, it's a beautiful brown, is beige, oh, I love this one, 3042, that's a beautiful color. 3348 almost there guys lots of colors Whew. so many colors so many uh, 154 one of my favorites 156 157 210 310 the black let's take a look at the quality of that yeah, there's actually not much black in the painting. I like that a lot. So, and the quality of the drill seems to be very good. There are a tad, always a tad on the smaller side, so you might have some gapping um, at Dreamer Designs. 311, 312, 321, 368, and 420 and we're almost there and now we have the a b so let's go i'm gonna show you the other ones first <laughs> 38 36 my 38 38 38 55 much of that color beautiful yellowy color 38 60 Oh, I love these these kind of muted, very dirty, dirty kind of purple. I don't know. It's just a bizarre shade, lovely shade. Thirty-eight sixty-one, and now we've got the first AB, and AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which means, of course, the Northern Lights. And that means that there's an extra coating on your drills to make them shine just that little bit more. And this one is a white. Then we've got a little bit of purpley. Again, dirty purpley, dirty lilac. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All my colors are dirty today. So that's a beautiful one. You've got a beautiful green and then you've got a light blue so those are the ab's let's check where they go in the painting and i hope they're not in bizarre places like dreamer designs sometimes they have their ab's in very strange places so first we need to find the dots and that goes here a little bit in the chickadee, a little bit in the flower here, and bum 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 here also some here, 
and here in the plants on top so it's a little bit scattered all over the painting then we've got the green a b that's a triangle and that goes oh that goes here and here and here and here also and there so yeah all scattered and i really like it when it's like that because otherwise uh, look and it's here around the plant so yeah it's gonna be great then you've got this symbol wait uh, wait i will show you where it is um that's the pink ab that goes into the chick a little bit here the chicky there there in the plant here in the flower i mean in the flower some here in the chickies so that's also here in the plants so yeah that's also a little bit scattered around and then the white one that goes <laughs> here in the the decorative i think that's a fence like thing uh, like here and here and then hmm, do we have some yeah we have some in the chickies so the chickies will be very blinged up we've got here some in the chickies here in the chickies in the flower here so they're really all over the place so yeah this is gonna be a lovely painting very um colorful and and also very bling i really like this one it's it's something i'm not really sh used to but i'm gonna love working on this i think um i don't see symbols that could give me a headache but i use a light pad anyways all the time so i don't really care so I'm going to clean this up, um, just stay around a little bit because I'm going to show you the progress I'm making on the one I'm working on now, so stay tuned, just a second. So I'm back. Um, this is the one I'm working on right now, it's called Where the Fun Never Ends by Mandy Manzano, you know the one I'm doing for the Pride Month, that is done, but yeah. We still keep working on the paintings. I'm uh, almost halfway, so now I'm working on the rainbow here. I already did um, Princess Bubblina, uh, Rainy Corn, and the Ice King, and um, the, the sword that Finn is holding. I did his head already. So, yeah. Um, and the rainbow here so my first thoughts on this painting is <laughs> it's actually really fun to work on so and i like the fact that um the rendering is like uh it's not all the time full colors but you see there are many colors um many elements that make this very interesting like in the rainbow it's not just plain the color of the rainbow but you can see some um some circles in it and some other colors and and like these elements that make it very interesting um i had a tough time with this part because it was always uh although the rendering is very good but uh it was a bit too much of the same color for me, but yeah, that's that's the cartoony thingy. So, and of course, I'm blinging it up with lots more ABs. So, the ones that come in the uh, in the painting are I don't know if I can show you, but uh, for example, in her face, can I show you? I don't know, but there are pink ABs in the kit and green ABs. As you can see there on top, there are some ABs. Mm, the camera doesn't really pick them up, so. But I changed it up. I'm using um, an additional six or seven ABs. Don't know, I should count them. 
And also what I changed up was I put some electric uh, beads that I had left over from DIY Moon Shop in her crown. But I really love the way it's rendered. It's, it's not all... Um, like here you see these curly things and, and I like this very much about this painting. So here you can see the castle and you can see some trees. And um, yeah, I'm using some red ABs, uh, some purple ABs and especially white ABs also. So the mountains will be glistening because I thought, yeah, it's snow and, and it's... Uh, I didn't put any in his beard because that would make it weird. But I tried to bling up the crown a little bit. So I'm, I'm really having a, a good time working on this. I cannot lie. I'm not um, very fond of the work of Mandy Manzano. Uh, I do have one other in my possession and that's Matt Kitty. So that's one that's discontinued, I believe. But um, that's one I really wanted to have because I love Matt Kitty. Um, but normally this is not my style. But I like working on it nevertheless. And I know exactly the place where I'm going to hang it. I'm going to hang it um, at a small part of the wall. Uh, there's a really small wall and this will be perfect. It's, it just fits and it's where my children sit down at the computers to play. So, because this is from a children's series, I thought this would be a fun idea too. And, and it brings some color in the, in the living room. So that's the, that's the progress I've made. And um, if you're planning on buying this one, uh, go ahead. It's really fun. It might take you a longer time to... Uh, finish but you won't get really tired of it because it has uh, very much um, differentiation and and you know you can fill in the black all the time with different colors and I really like it so then another where I've been working on and I've done a little bit already this one for summers with the masters this is for my mandolin player so I am working on this square and um, I'm actually already happy with the way it turns out. Um, I'm sorry, there's much glare so I cannot really show you. But I'm having a hard time um, getting my line straight because it's a poured glue but it's very strong glue. Once you put down your... your your drill you have to really you cannot really move it around very good because it's it's so strong the glue so that's why i'm having a little bit of trouble working on this one um i work on this one when i'm bored doing <laughs> doing all rounds all the time so to spice things up a little bit, I'm doing this one. And also I want to finish this before Summers with the Masters is over. So so yeah, that's my progress so far. Uh, of course, I'm going to be back. I've um, got some interesting line paintings coming. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell to be notified anytime I put up another video. And... Um, if you leave, just give me a thumbs up so I know you appreciate this content. And yeah, that's all I've got for you guys for today. So stay safe, have a fabulous day and hope to see you in the next video. Bye!